Hey guys, it's Shannon and today I am sharing my highly requested long awaited vanity tour kind of before with you. So those of you that have been watching know that I had mentioned somewhat recently that I ordered a new vanity from Pottery Barn because I had been obsessing about it for a really long time and I, I like my current setup but it has some challenges. Storage is definitely an issue. So um, Paul told me to go ahead and get the vanity and I waited and waited and waited and then I'm like, you know what? They sent me an awesome coupon. I'm getting the vanity. <laughs> so I went ahead and ordered it, but it's on back order. So I've already been waiting, hmm, I think maybe like a month. And I'm hoping it's gonna come this month in May. It's supposed to, but you know, I haven't heard anything from them yet, so we'll see. But I kind of wanted to just share the current setup I have. And let's see, I am going to flip the camera around, maybe. Sorry guys, I don't know what you were seeing there. <laughs> I'm gonna show you over here in my mirror, just a little update for those of you that asked. Yes, I did get this dress. Um, I had the, uh, what was it, in the vlog, Let's Go Shopping, I tried on some dresses. So I bought all three that I showed in that vlog. So that's just a little update on that. But okay, so here's the deal. <laughs> um, let's see, how do I start this? Uh, so my vanity is over there in the corner, right there. We'll look at that in a minute. And I'll just kind of show you this half of the room. Um, this is my side of the room, obviously, unless Paul's into makeup and <laughs> mannequins and mirrors. Um, and this is my dresser as well, right here, as well as a big pile of Shopkins because, you know, it's just the way it is. <laughs> So I have this dresser right here and it has makeup in that bottom drawer, which I can't show because it also has some girly things, <laughs> which I'm not going to show that. But what I'm thinking of doing, the new vanity I'm getting is really big. It's tall because it has a big, huge mirror on the top and it's also really wide. So I'm thinking that I'm going to put the vanity here on this wall. And then I'm thinking that that dresser right there, I'm actually gonna move over in the corner there where my vanity is now. So we'll have to see once I actually get it. But okay, let's come a little closer. Take a look at the mess. Yes, it is very, very messy. <laughs> so, oh look, you can see me in the mirror. So that's the top of the vanity see I don't even know the best way to show you guys this okay maybe this so here's my chair I love my chair I love this chair it's so pretty it's like a gray and it has these little silver studs all over it I love that but what I'm gonna do is pull it out of the way so we can take a better look over here so I have this dresser and I just mentioned a few minutes ago about storage being an issue and you'll see why I say that in a minute so most people, I think, have clothes in their dressers. I have some clothes, but I have makeup stuff as well. <laughs> I don't even know what's in these drawers right now. So um, obviously this top drawer has makeup stuff. I have samples here of some stuff and then just some different things, brush cleaner and moisturizers and different um, different foundations. Hey, check that out. <laughs> That's a Viva Glam lip gloss from MAC. I used mine up and I forgot I had bought a replacement. I am so excited about that. It's a good thing I did this guys. <laughs> so um, anyway, there's just some different makeup here. There's some more stuff I have extras of this. I love that. And I have some MAC Simpsons lip gloss there. But here's just kind of a quick look. I'm not technically doing like a makeup tour. I know some of you wanted to see the makeup stuff I have. You know, I'm not gonna go through everything. I'm just kind of showing some of the stuff that I have here. So that drawer has makeup. And let's open this drawer. I'm kind of afraid. Okay. <laughs> This drawer is filled with a lot of extra makeup bags that I should probably just get rid of. I have like wipes to clean my mirrors and stuff. 
a ton of the little, um, oh, what do you call those things from Bath and Body Works? I, I can't think of what they're called, but just the little bulbs. Oh, duh, it says right there, wallflowers. I have a ton of hand sanitizers. Yes, I do have quite the back stock of stuff. <laughs> So this drawer is full and I use this drawer just because I don't have space anywhere else. And then if we come over here, this is the nail polish drawer. Keep in mind, I haven't thrown any nail polishes away. And I kind of have a thing for nail polish and my mother-in-law buys me a bunch too. <laughs> but this is the nail polish drawer. So these two bins are filled with nail polish and then I have like just you know supplies and stuff in here as well there are more nail polishes so this is something that I'm hoping that I can store in the new vanity so I can actually use my dresser for clothes that would be cool okay so let's go take a look over here now okay so we'll start right here and then we'll look at the vanity at the end so right here in this bag are just all of the like makeup organizer things that I shared that I got from Dollar Tree. I just have them in this bag, just waiting until I get the new vanity to organize. Okay, and then that brings us to this area right here. It used to look better than it does now because these things on top didn't used to be here. So let me go ahead and move those And this. And let me show you what it used to look like. So it's supposed to look like this. And for a long time, this organization worked for me. I just have my trash can there. That is a back to Mac bag. So I just keep the um, Mac items that I've used up because if you take six items back in, they give you a free lipstick, which is pretty cool. And then that bag right there in the corner is filled with tons of samples. Like when you spend a certain amount of money, you know, you get the free um, you know, 21 piece beauty kit or whatever. That's stuff I just kind of need to go through and either use or donate, but I've just, you know, for now it's contained right there. And then these kind of held my other makeup because I'm sitting on the floor. So you can kind of see right here, I have the desktop and I have one teeny tiny little drawer right here, which barely holds anything. So I put like my makeup that I rotate in these bins. So let me show you these. I love these little trunks. They're super cute. So this one originally was supposed to house my palettes. So, you know, I keep a few palettes. Well, originally I was only keeping like one or two palettes on my table at a time. And then I would just kind of rotate. But I ended up having a lot more up on my... Um, vanity than I thought but I'm trying to get this open I have not looked at this palette in a long time there we go that's pretty just a lot of browns okay let's let's not let's not blind you guys but anyway so here are palettes so I have some Stila palettes and what's down there some balm palettes and this was like a free thing from Estee Lauder. It was like a collaboration with Lily Pulitzer. Another Balm palette. I love that one. <laughs> Balm Jovi. Here's an Urban Decay palette. Too Faced. There's a MAC palette. So this was my palette case. Go ahead and lock that one up. And then let me show you this one. This one was like everything else. So it's just kind of... A mess. I have some samples in here like this is a really deluxe sample but then I just have all kinds of stuff in here I mean actually a lot of these things were samples these came from like some big deluxe sample pack I got but you can just see I mean there's tons of lip products in here all of these are brand new I haven't used before so yeah this is this is just all makeup I need to get to at some point and like I said, this is new product in here. So I don't feel so bad about keeping it because I haven't dug into any of it yet. But so that is that part of my makeup. And then I got some more stuff and I ran out of space. So I started stacking. 
and I'm going to show you that right now. One of the things is my mother-in-law got me this big case from Ulta this Christmas. It's filled with makeup, so that sits up there. I have extra baby wipes. I use those when I put my makeup on just to like kind of um, wipe my hands off with foundation and stuff. I have my Minnie Mouse palette. So cute. It looks like a little clutch purse. And then I have two MAC things that I just had to have. Girl Band Glam and Fun and Flirty. I haven't even taken the stuff out of these yet. That's how bad I am. So those are just sitting there too. So that's that. Now let's go ahead and take a look at the top of the vanity. Okay, so this is the top of the vanity. Here's the little drawer I was telling you about. It's just a very shallow drawer. It doesn't hold much at all. So I just have a couple palettes in there and some different things. And then on top, this is a bag of the makeup that I just bought on my recent trip to the mall. And then you can just see what has become of this. This used to be really clean. I have a pretty tray there that had my makeup brushes and stuff. It used to be nice. <laughs> I have this really cool lip gloss and a lipstick container and then things just got out of hand because I don't have storage I have too much stuff a lot of these things here you can see are samples all these you know these and then it's just an empty container there's just so much stuff so like these are brand new things that I just bought and showed I have a palette up here that I just showed and stuff and I just I don't have anywhere to put the stuff so there is just a quick glimpse again of everything on here. It would be really cool to get this organized and looking good again. That's my hope. So I'm really looking forward to getting the new vanity and having more storage. I think it has a lot of drawers, so that's going to be awesome. And um, yeah, so what I'll do is I will show you guys. Here, let's see. Let's see. Let's turn the camera around. You might be able to see outside for a minute. Okay, um, I will definitely show you guys, you know, when I get the new vanity and kind of how it's set up. And if you would like to see a more detailed makeup collection where I actually kind of like go through and show all the eyeshadow palettes and all the, you know, lipsticks and all that, um, or nail polish, I would be happy to do that. Just leave a comment and let me know. And um, yeah, I would do that for you. I think that'd be a lot of fun. So. I hope you guys enjoyed this. It's kind of like a quick look at my current setup. And um, like I said, I will definitely show you the after as well. So thanks so much for watching. If you have any questions or comments, please leave it down in the comments for me. And I do read all those. I'm having a really hard time right now responding to everything because between our two channels, I'm being kept pretty busy. But um, I do read them. And I appreciate each and every single one of them and you guys for watching. So go ahead and leave those comments and thank you so much. I'll see you next time, guys. Bye.